hope you're doing good. So what does a replacement look like in the real world? A lot of companies, you guys, won't allow replacements for telesales. Or if they do, they need a wet ink signature. Not a problem. This is why it's important to work in your own backyard. Work close, you guys. Or at least, for goodness sakes, work your own state. I would have lost out on well over $1,000 of comp if I was working in some other state because I needed to get it handled, okay? It needs a wet ink signature, and it's one of those things you gotta just do it, okay? Could you mail it? Maybe, but certain carriers won't let you do it. This particular telephonic carrier would allow me to do the application by phone, but then they needed a wet ink signature within so many days. So what did I do? I went on a field trip. That's why I'm talking to you in my car, all right? So it's a lot of fun, but when you go on your little field trips, like what I'm doing, I'm heading back to my office to get back on the phones to go make my telesales, all right? But when you go on a field trip, ask secondary questions. There are more sales in that home than just the initial sale, okay? I drove all the way to this sweet lady's house, full disclosure, went over the buyer's guide with her on life insurance, went over my policy, how it was so superior to this graded piece of junk she bought through the mail, okay? And then the conservation department from the other company, talk about a laughing stock, it was stupid sweet lady and she was just dying laughing she's like are you kidding me it was a graded policy and they're like oh well this policy has great cash value and she's like listen ding dong okay you don't even pay a death benefit until into the third year seriously cancel the thing it was ridiculously awesome this lady was so fun so fun do right by people and you're representing the best a-rated carriers she had another agent that came out there sold her medical insurance okay wrote her like a plan in in my state never mentioned to her about what a plan G does or the other plans that are offered, okay? The telesales space, you can sell med subs. You can, it's not what I focus on. I do that in person. But while I'm out there on my little field trip doing a replacement, guess what I did, guys? I sold a plan G med sup. I gave her the options. I said, listen, I'm an independent insurance agent. Take a peek. You've got a plan in. I can do the exact same plan in. Your coverage doesn't change, but you have me as your agent and I'll charge you less a month than what you signed up for. And she's like, really? You can save me money? I'm like, absolutely. Go over the features and benefits of what she owns. I did a side-by-side -side on the Plan G. And guess what? She saw extreme value in the Plan G with me. And that's what she chose. It was her choice, not mine. Be an information encyclopedia. Be that warehouse of knowledge to guide your clients in information, but let them choose. She made her decision. I didn't say, wow, you should go for a G. Not at all. Just went over, this is what your current policy does. This is what the G could do for you. Yes, it costs a little bit more a month for a G, but it's cheaper than the company you're with for the same G. And if you do a plan in with me, guess what? That's cheaper as well with me because I'm an independent agent. I'm not captive. I'm not hamstrung with only one company with no other room for movement. It's so important. So important, you guys, to be an independent agent and have resources. Would have never had that sale if I didn't have the offerings of products that I do. Product knowledge, yes, but it's about offerings. You got to have more than one product, okay? It's important to have many companies. Just today, she bought a, a policy online. And I came in, right, with a policy that was first day full coverage for like way less a month. We're talking like $40 less a month, you guys. 40 bucks, and it was a big name company. I replaced it today and gave her first day full coverage. I'm getting referrals out of that house, let me tell you. And I got two pieces of business on my field trip. I hope your day today is nothing short of amazing. This is my fourth sale. It's three o'clock, not a bad day. And I didn't get on the phones till a little later today because I was helping some of my agents. You guys, work hard, grind hard, enjoy what you do, enjoy, okay, the season that you're in. If you're an agent, be a really good agent. Put the hustle muscle to use, but skill up. Get ready to go. I'm doing a telesales seminar coming up. Check David Duford's site out, partner with him. It's gonna be fun, you guys. Get ready, have a good day. Hope you're slaying it. Hope today's amazing and tomorrow even better.